I wouldn't eat that. Maybe I would actually. Yeah, I, I don't actually, know. Actually, it looks okay. I don't know that it's fermented and that's how it's got that hair. Oh, did it just grow the hair? I think so, like a, f a fermentation, I think. So Mom, I'm really excited to introduce you to a new Chinese vlogger called Dian Xi Xiaoge. So she is very similar to Li Zixi in that she's in the countryside. She loves rural, traditional Chinese methods of making food and clothes and all these different types of things, but with a focus on nature and the rural countryside of China. Great. Awesome. So I did a little bit of research on it beforehand mm -hmm. and it appears that she is similar to Li Zixi, but she's also very unsimilar. So reading on the internet, a lot of Wang Yao, Chinese netizens said that their style is different. Li Zixi is quite cold. She doesn't talk to the camera. It's very artistic and removed. Well, Jian Xi Xiaoge is the opposite of that. She's very chatty. She chats with everyone in the village. Um, mm. Her videos are a bit more straightforward and warm. So Jian Xi Xiaoge is from Yunnan, which is the province of China that's close to Myanmar and Laos. So it's in the very south mm. of China. Yeah. Now Yunnan is famed because it's always really sunny there. It's a very temperate climate. Mm. So what that allows Jian Xi Xiaoge to do is grow lots of different things because it's always hot there. Mm -hmm. And she's very famous for having a big Alaskan dog that's really cute within the films. So that's one of, yeah, the things that people like about her. And yeah, the area that she lives in typically is quite impoverished. And so this just shows an insight into it, a positive insight. Um, so yeah. Wow, I'm really looking forward to watching, to watching this. Dianxi Xiao Ge. Dianxi Xiao. Xiao Ge. Good. Excellent. So thank you to all of our fans and Guanzhong who recommended saying if you like Li Zixi, you will also like Dian Xi Xiao Ge. So yeah. shall we take a look at this back to rural Yunnan video? Fabulous, can't wait. All right, here we go then. Dian Xi Xiao Ge. First time we've watched her and she today is making <laughs> something called Mao Dofu, which in English. Is that tofu? It's hairy tofu. <laughs> hairy. <laughs> so hairy I don't tofu. know whether it's going to be tasty or not. You didn't like chordofu, did you? Stinky, Stinky tofu. tofu. <laughs> Let's have a look at uh, Dianxi Xiaoge. They're peas. I don't know what they are. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. And rice. Another grandma. <laughs> I think there's lots of family members in this video stuff. Uh, it's also my first time watching. Alright. Oh, what's this? Is that Dou Jiang? Tofu. Is that tofu way? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So you can see the buildings are quite tr back to basics, right? Yeah. I've tried to make tofu, but I failed. <laughs> so DNC, by the way, is um, the name of the area that she's from in Yunnan. A xiao ge. Xiao ge, the meaning is like small brother. <laughs> if anyone can explain to me why she's called brother and not sister, let me know. <laughs> I'm really interested in watching her make tofu because I, I do like to eat tofu. Tofu's your favourite, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It is actually your favourite. We it, did a it video is. It on is. what your favourite food is. <laughs> so my favourite all-time Chinese food Drum is roll. tofu. Yeah. Tofu. I've been eating it for a long time, years, 35 years. 
but I've never made it. Oh, look, it's set. Oh, that, that doesn't look very pleasant to me. Oh, Can you like does, the look of that? Yeah, it's like silken toffee, we call it here. Silken. It's soft. Oh, like oh. in the wooden box. They're pressing it down then. Oh, what's this? She's not very chatty so far, though. She's not squirming. Yeah, no, we've not heard her speak so far. Oh, wow. What's Maybe it's just on this video. She shows a face more than Leeds of Tea, though. Yes. I feel like Leeds of Tea is kind of a bit mysterious. Yeah. Whereas, apparently, she's more kind of easy to engage with. Ugh! When it, where did the hair come from? I don't know. When did the hair get added? It's a lot faster paced as well, this, isn't it? I wouldn't eat that. Maybe I would actually. Yeah, I, I don't. Actually, know. it looks okay. I don't know that it's fermented, and that's how it's got that hair. Oh, did it just grow the hair? I think so, like a, f a fermentation. I think. That I've got to say, it looks very strange. So the Chinese yes. Chinese title of this was Ni Trigorma, which is "Have you eaten it?" And we've never eaten. I've never, adult, hairy, yeah. hairy oh, I've never seen it either. Uh, it's not hairy anymore. Oh. Hmm. Oh, well, I'd eat that. <laughs> That's hairy, isn't it? Yeah. Making like a sauce. Yeah, I'd eat that. So she's saying, quick, come and eat. <laughs> Look, there's family, I guess. Yeah. Mum, dad and grandparents. Oh. Spices. That it's all so slow and precise. Whoa. I missed what was happening. Yeah. yeah, to be honest, I think it's quite fast paced. There's loads going on. It's faster than leaves of tea. I guess that's just you in it. It's like a fermenty. Wow. So then, Mum, what were your first thoughts on Junxi Xiao Ke? Yes, I really enjoyed the video. I enjoyed watching the process of the tofu mm. making, it, even though some of it I didn't understand. Mm. It was very similar to um, the other videos that we watched by Lisa Chi. And I think because we've seen quite a few of hers now, and we, I really like them. Um, is that it, I, I need to see more of um, this particular person. You prefer Leeds and Chi at the moment? Yeah. <laughs> That's okay. Well, we can okay. watch more of Jin Xi, Xiao Ge, and maybe she will also grow to us. I like the fact that she is, you can tell, the videos are less prepared, yes. a bit more realistic. Um, looks like there's more family members involved. We didn't get to see her dog, uh -huh. and we didn't get to see her talk very much. Um, but yeah. But we're going to definitely watch more because we like this style of video, don't yes. we? It gives a real insight into activities and oh, cultures yeah. Yeah. and foods that we know nothing about. Yes, but that is true. I lived in China before for seven years. I never went to Yunnan. I never barely even touched like anywhere close to Yunnan. So there's still so much left for us to discover. Yeah. 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 Right. I think we'll wrap it up there then. Okay. What do we want them to do? Oh. Like and subscribe. Awesome. Really see one hundred tea shipping. Can you get one with the end down? Or one hundred one with the end down? Holly.
Okay then. Bye bye. Bye.